the soup's gonna end up being raw. Make a little tortilla soup. It'll be done here in a sec if you wanna stick around. So the longer you let it spin, the warmer it gets, right? You can stand right over here in front of him. Just right in front of that red uh, box he's got in his hand. How are you doing today? We can't get anybody to watch a Vitamix demonstration. You guys already own one? Almost. <laughs> Almost? Okay, well, on your way back, we'll just put one in your cart. But see, even like a regular a processed soup, any kind of processed soup that you take home and you warm up, they've actually been cooked already. So there's zero nutrients in it. Even like a can of soup, that's been cooked about 400 degrees before it goes in the can. It's got a ton of sodium, a ton of preservatives. So it's uh, actually, according to the American Heart Association, one of the top 10 worst things you put in your body is a can of soup. How are you doing, ma'am? Ready for a little soup? All right, we're about ready now. I'm gonna warm my water up a little bit more. It should be pretty good now, though. Good enough to eat. So we're just gonna turn that off there. I'm gonna put another tomato in there. And we're gonna chop it up. Now, since you got this little pulse button here, now yours, you're just gonna turn on one, yeah. On this pulse button, we can just chop that tomato in little chunks, make it chunky. Put it back on one, we're gonna turn it on again. Now this is when you put your meat, your beans, your corn, and all that stuff in there. And we're gonna actually put the chips in at the very end. So you do that right before you serve it. Makes it nice and chunky. Do you have a Vitamix machine, huh? Man, it's a good thing we're here together, huh? It's like fate that brought us together here. But we just let that chop up a little bit. Turn it off, and then we serve. So there is a warmed up raw tortilla soup that's actually good for you. It has all the raw nutrition, all the raw digestive enzymes in it. And it takes just as long to make a raw soup in here that it does to make a processed soup on your stove. So give that a shot. And then we're gonna go right into a green drink. We're gonna show you what you should start.